Hi, this is Michelle from It's Our Time Now. Do you know that sometimes, even when you are in the will of God, that things might get rocky or rough sometimes? In the Bible, it tells a um, tale, I don't like to use the word tale, but it talks about when Jesus had told the disciples to get into the boat and to, and he said, let's go to the other side. So they were in God's will doing what God had told them, doing what Jesus had told them when they were going to the other side of the lake. But while they were going to the other side of the lake, a storm arose. And sometimes you are in the will of God and a storm might arise in your life. And that was a literal storm with the clouds and the rain and winds and everything like that. But in your life, it might be some kind of other type of storm whether it's something with your body, sickness, or your family, some other type of storm might arise, but that does not mean that you are not in the will of God. So the um, disciples were so upset that they went down. Jesus was resting because he knew that they were going to make it. So he's in the bottom of the ship resting, relaxing, and they're all scared because of the winds and the waves that are going about. So they go down there and they say, hey, don't you care? Or carest thou not that we perish? And he looked at them and he's like, well, why are you not believing that you're going to make it? I'm the one who told you to go. I'm the one who told you to do it. So he just looked at the winds and the waves and he said, peace be still. And so I just wanted to admonish you that in your life, sometimes even though you are doing the will of God, you are doing what God told you to do. Sometimes it might get rough. It might get windy. The rain might start falling. It might be a stormy storm outside. It might be storming. But trust that if God told you to do it, and you're doing it like he said for you to do it, that you'll make it to the other side. And then there will be peace, and that storm will calm. And that, I'm sorry, and that storm will calm, and you'll be all right. So just trust God and obey him and do what he said, and trust that he will still the storm. And remember, it's our time now. God bless you.